Walmart cuts to starting pay for some new hires and new health care insurance costs are taking the biggest jumps in years. Jane King is at the NASDAQ with those stories and more in today's Morning Business Report. Good morning, employers and workers are expected to see an increase of at least 6.5% in health plan costs next year. That's according to major benefit consulting firms Mercer and Willis Towers Watson. Hospitals, higher labor costs, and heavy demand for new and expensive diabetes and obesity drugs are to blame. While a record 73 million Americans plan to bet on the NFL this season, the American Gaming Association says it expects a nearly 60% increase over last year. 14% plan to place their bets as betting becomes legal in more states. Well, the Nasdaq fell for a fourth session as the threat of higher interest rates hurts tech stocks the most. And according to a CNBC survey, Americans' financial stress has increased significantly over the summer. About 4 in 10 Americans with a 401k plan don't contribute anything to it. Financial advisors say paying off high interest debt while still building savings can help reduce financial stress. And Walmart is paying some new store workers less than it would have just three months ago, a sign employers are seeking to cut labor costs. Walmart says the change in pay structure allows workers to do different jobs across the store, learning new skills and moving up the company. From the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King with your Morning Business Report.